guys, so in my last vlog I announced the return of the Foot of a Ferret Q&A and I asked you guys to leave me questions and you did not disappoint. So let's not waste any more time and get right to it. Do you like My Chemical Romance? If so, what is your favorite song slash album? I love My Chemical Romance. My favorite song is Welcome to the Black Parade, and my favorite album is The Black Parade. My love for that album stems almost entirely from the amazing music video for the title track. Seriously, if you have not seen the music video for Welcome to the Black Parade, look it up as soon as you can. If you like Tim Burton-esque imagery and epic alternative rock music, you will love this video. Opinions on the 12th Doctor and the Doctor Who Christmas special, and warning the following answer may be a bit spoilery. The Doctor Who Christmas special was great, and Matt Smith's send-off was virtually perfect. Perfect. I'm still a little bit confused as to how the Doctor was able to turn young again before regenerating, but the story, the humor, the characters, and the countless callbacks to series 5 and 6 made it a more than fitting cap off to the Matt Smith years. As for the 12th Doctor, the little bit that we saw of him at the end of the special really got me excited for series 8, and honestly, that's all he had to do. Of course, I'm not going to form a full opinion on him until I see his first series, but... I am excited. What is the story behind your logo? If you look at a lot of my videos from early 2013, you'll notice two different types of thumbnails. Brief history thumbnails were characterized by the stopwatch, and at the time, vlog thumbnails were characterized by the multicolored test bars. So when the time came to design a logo for my channel, I decided that the best thing to do was to take these two characteristics and combine them into one symbol that represented all of my channel, and thus the Foot of a Fair logo was born. Have you seen Sherlock Season 3? No, at the time of filming this, I have not seen any of Sherlock Season 3. But because it's the internet, and the internet is the internet, a lot of major plot points have been spoiled for me, and it makes me upset. But despite that, I love Sherlock. The actors are amazing, the stories are ridiculously clever, but what makes the show absolutely extraordinary is the video editing. Hands down, some of the most clever video editing and cinematography I've seen in anything ever. It's a huge inspiration for me. What is your favorite movie character, and could you please answer in the form of a drawing? <laughs> I think I got some, like, pencil lead or something on my nose from that sketchbook, so that's probably gonna be there for the rest of the video, so... Forewarning. What is your favorite song at the moment? That is an incredibly difficult question to answer, but I'm going to say Dumped by Newfound Glory. For those of you who do not know, Newfound Glory is a pop punk band from Coral Springs, Florida. Basically, I watched one of their music videos because Haley Williams was in it, and then I realized that Haley actually dates Chad Gilbert, the guitarist for Newfound Glory. And from then on, I just became a fan of them in their own right. They may not be for everyone because the singer does have an incredibly nasally voice, but to be honest, I love his voice. I think it perfectly fits the upbeat and youthful style of the band. And their melodies are incredibly catchy. Once you listen to them, songs like Dumped, Anthem for the Unwanted, and Hold My Hand will be stuck in your head for days. So if you haven't done so already, definitely check out the band Newfound Glory. I recommend their album Radio Surgery. Why the hat? <sighs> oh, no reason. I know you're a Whovian, but are you in any other fandoms? Mmm, no, not really. Who do you think will be the most popular YouTubers in three years? I feel like three years from now, the YouTube Digerati will be more or less the same, but with a relatively large batch of new YouTubers sprinkled in. People like the Vlog Brothers, Tobuscus, and Dan and Phil will still very much be a large part of the scene, but at the same time, new YouTubers who are just starting to gain traction now will most likely have hundreds of thousands of subscribers by then. I particularly see people like Nerdy and Quirky, the Super Carlin Brothers, and T. Michael Martin fitting into this category. And in a stirring turn of events, PewDiePie will stop making videos, and YouTube will have no idea what to do about this. So out of habit, they will just continue to push and push his channel until he becomes the first person on YouTube to hit 100 million subscribers. Why is your hat so awesome? Because it is on my head. A brief history of Panic at the Disco! Green Day! Tim Burton! How excited are you for Monumentor? So for those of you who do not know, the Monumentor is a summer US tour that features Fall Out Boy and my favorite band, Paramore. And I will be attending the Monumentor this coming July, and not only that, I purchased a meet and greet ticket package, which means I'm going to meet Paramore. I am currently the envy of preteen girls around the world. If you could join one band, what would it be and what would you play? If that didn't really answer your question, the answer is Paramore and Guitar. The story behind my username is an incredibly underwhelming story that I will tell you when I hit 100,000 subscribers. Today's viewer mail comes from... Nobody. Because nobody sent me anything this week. So, if you have something you would like to send to me to put on the wall behind me, please send it to Ryder Bergen, P.O. Box 5403, Statesville, North Carolina, 28687. Don't forget, if you have a question you would like me to answer in a future video, please leave it in the comments below, or on my Twitter, at Ryder Bergen, or on my Tumblr, footofaffair at .tumblr.com. And I'll see you in a week, guys. DFTBA.
So for those of you who do not know, the Monument Tour is a summer U.S. tour that features favorite mosh debut. Ah, <laughs> And I will be attending the Monument Tour this coming July, and not only that, I purchased a meet and greet ticket package. It's the amazing Bobinski. Because amazing, I already know that I am.